Hey guys, very good evening to all of you. In today's video, I'm going to talk about construction project management. Yes, and this video is totally on demand. Everyone was asking me about construction project management. So here I am talking about it. And guys, I'll be covering topics such as which colleges are the best colleges for construction project management? What are the subjects that you will be learning in that course? How much this course will cost? What will be the career opportunities after that? How much will be your salary? And which colleges will give you the best opportunity for co-op? So, all this will be in this video so try watching this video till the end and guys for the people who are here on my channel for the first time my name is Saransh Singh and I keep making such videos on a regular basis so feel free to check out my other playlist also and guys without any delays let's get started with the video so guys first thing first what is construction project management so basically architects make the design the structural engineers make the structural design then architecture technician makes the working drawing and when the working drawings are approved on-site constructions commences but before the construction is starting there comes the construction project manager so the construction project manager will do the cost estimation the project estimates the entire workflow how the workflow will be there there will be a lot of consultations involved in your construction project so all these things will be managed by project managers and project management team so this is a very important part for a flawless construction on site because architects and the project managers won't be going on site and looking after this so then there comes project manager so project construction manager will be taking care of all these things and project construction managers even go for the bidding of projects so there's a lot to learn about construction project management and there is a lot to earn in project construction management so this is the overview of the entire course and now let's talk about what will be the cost of this course so i have searched a lot of universities a lot of colleges and i have come to a conclusion that nowhere it is costing below twenty five thousand dollars to thirty five thousand dollars so the total range of this course will be 25 to 30 or 35 and in some universities because universities are obviously expensive it will cost you around 45k for two years of course so keep that in mind and colleges are good as well if you have some experience and if you are interested in this field you can definitely go for colleges and now coming to the courses that will be taught to you or the subjects that will be taught to you in this entire tenure of one year or two years of your course so if you are going for a one year course you will have around two to three semesters and in this semesters you will be taught all these courses i have made a list and it they they were a lot of there were a lot of subjects so i had to make a list i can't memorize it so here is the list for you so the first will be project delivery methods second will be construction methods and norm third will be occupational health safety security and third fourth will be business principles in semester two you will be learning about quantity surveying estimate and bidding procedures so as i have already told you so you will be participating in the bidding process also so in bidding you have to follow certain norms certain criteria so you have to develop a project proposal with the estimate of the project and you have to bid for that project so here the process is a bit different but in india also we do the similar thing so you know the basic outline of what this subject would be like third is your construction scheduling i have already spoken about this you will be using a lot of scheduling softwares like sometimes people use navis work but mostly people are using microsoft project it is very very helpful and very nice software and you should look into it because we had con project construction uh, project management course in green architecture that's why i know a little bit about it so next is cost planning and control next and after that you will have 
project monitoring and quality control and safety this is also a very important part because safety is something that is taken to a great level in canada because the compensation if something goes wrong or someone gets hurt on site is a huge huge deal over here not not like india like it is a big deal over there but here it's too much of loss for the construction company architecture company and the client so i have made a list of the colleges that will offer you co-op so the first on my list is conestega college so i don't know if i'm pronouncing it right or not but they offer co-op second is lambton college even that is offering co-op and uh, the first one that that is there on my list is the Fanshaw College. Uh, it offers co-op. I have spoken to one of the students in Fanshaw College, like he was a previous student, but uh, he has done his construction project management. And uh, I am trying to get him for an interview on this channel, but I am trying to get more other professions, professionals who have more experience in Canada. So it is under negotiation, but I will get someone to give an interview on this channel. So stay tuned and uh, go for the colleges that are offering you some co-op opportunity. So right now, like my perspective towards co-op has totally changed and uh, I know the importance of co-op right now. And I think so if you are there in India, do not make my mistake. Go for the courses that offer you co-op. The end nothing else to say now coming to the most important point what are the job opportunity here in canada ontario or any other province over here for construction project managers um, i think so there are a lot of opportunities i do see a lot of uh, project managers job opening and entry level project manager job openings also so I would say like, you know, if you are planning to come to Canada and go for all these courses, take some experience for a year or something of a managing a project or in a company as a project manager or something like that. So like after completing your course or after doing your co-op or something, you will get a good job plus a good package. Now coming to the next point, what will be your salary? So this is something that uh, was I was blown away with. So the salary will range from 60K a year to 90K a year. This is just a beginning gist of the salary. An average base salary was around $75,000 a year. That means a person will be earning more than an architecture technician or an intern architect anytime so i just want to say like this is the entire scenario over here and soon a video i will make with someone from construction project management to interview to give an interview over here and uh, we will see we will share their experience we will have a good conversation and i hope you will learn a lot from it and you have already learned a lot from this video itself and if you have go ahead hit a like and subscribe to my channel and guys don't forget to share these videos don't forget to you know uh, motivate and guide other people also that's what i am doing over here and that's what you should be and all i expect from you is your support and your support is something that keeps me going and uh, that's it for today guys see you soon take care of yourself bye bye